Meantime, Massachusetts is closing four mass vaccination sites. Gillette Stadium, the Heinz Convention Center, Natick Mall, and the Doubletree in Danvers will all close by the end of June. 12 News reporter Brittany Schaefer has more on the state's shift in vaccine strategy. It's regional vaccination clinics like La Salette Shrine here that Governor Charlie Baker says the state's efforts should turn to. Attleboro Mayor Paul Hero tells me on opening day here today, the site has already given hundreds of shots. At this point, we're adjusting our vaccine distribution strategy to be more targeted. Massachusetts is adapting their vaccination efforts to reach communities Governor Charlie Baker calls harder to reach. We hope to make this process more convenient, more accessible. Jamie Scanlon says the regional clinic at La Salette Shrine is just that for her. The Attleboro resident tells me she felt more comfortable going to a place she's familiar with. It was very exciting because I didn't want to go to Foxborough. They do the lights every year. Uh, we come here, take walks around. It's very nice. I like it. Uh, less nervous. The site vaccinated 300 people Monday with the capacity of 750 daily. Appointments can be made through the state's website. Attleboro Mayor Paul Hero tells me most people are in and out in 20 minutes. It's also right on the Gatra bus line. It's, you know, a bus let which has over 100,000 visitors a year. So it's got a lot of parking. So the, the, the location itself couldn't be better uh, to administer something like this. The roving clinic will be in Attleboro on Mondays and then the Medical Reserve Corps will set up shop in Taunton, Fall River, and Somerset. Those cities and towns have among the lowest vaccination rates in the state, despite having some of the highest infection rates throughout the pandemic. Hero says this clinic should help. If the rate of vaccination goes up, the rate of infection will go down. It makes a lot more sense to have uh, people given the vaccine in a regional clinic where it's closer to their home. And Hero tells me there were 40 appointment cancellations here today out of 300. He says that's disappointing, but they were able to call people in on the wait list. In Attleboro, I'm Brittany Schaefer, 12 News.